guys, we are going to Woodabon Park, which is Asia's biggest water park. Yeah, water park. I'm super excited. There's uh, one ride that Philly's not going to do, but I'm going to make her do it anyway. I don't know how much vlogging we can do because I didn't bring a GoPro because I didn't know we're going to Bali. So that's Philly's problem. I was going to go buy a GoPro, but you know what? Okay, let's go. Enjoy. If you guys enjoyed today's video, thumbs up. Subscribe button. Hit that bell button. That notifies you every single time we release brand new videos. But for real though, we're going to try to do as much filming as we can and we're going to use our iPhones to try film going down the slides. Not again. sure how, yeah, how good that is, but fingers crossed our iPhones don't break. Just made it inside the park and it already smells like chlorine. It's so good, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, we need to find a locker first. Just found us some lockers and we're going to put one in to put our camera and backpack. How does it work? And the good thing about this place is they give you a wristband and you put your own money on it so you don't actually have to carry cash, which is perfect. ride already which was really good what did you reckon babe i don't think she can hear me but we're gonna end it here um we're gonna just do this one more time and then yeah oh my god yeah that was great it was great back to our normal camera now Hello, mates. <laughs> we got uh Migurin, which is our favorite actually my favorite as well and you guys like look it comes with prawn crackers oh, no, and stuff show, it's all about the beer like the beer tank orange and lemon is it's changed his life. No, because yeah, it actually doesn't taste like alcohol. He was like such a hater about it. He's like, why do people love it so much? But it's actually really tasty. Yeah. It doesn't even taste like, like beer. Right. So good. And we're also waiting for some corn. This is what I really wanted, chili butter corn. However, it looks a little bit different to the one I had last time. Like that looks kind of like thick chutney style. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna like it. How's the mega ring? Great. Oh yay. Time to eat. We are back at our little villa now. Waterborne mm. Park was actually so mm. fun. We paid $40 AUD and we went on every single ride. We went on a few even two times. So I think we definitely got our money's worth. If we stayed the whole day, you will definitely get even more money's worth out of it. For sure, recommend going there really if you have that. like kids and stuff. They would enjoy it so much. But yes, the food was pretty expensive and it was pretty average. It wasn't like amazing or anything. So maybe we can't really bring food inside, but maybe what you can do is eat afterwards and go across the road to like the local markets and stuff because that food's really bomb and really cheap. But we just did a quick little photo shoot for these shorts right here. Same side shorts and my hair is looking really, shorts. really cool. My top is same side. Anyways, I'm now going to take my hair out because it is soaking wet, really heavy, and I want to go to get a massage later tonight and I want them to like massage my head and that's not really gonna happen with this. So this lasted like one day or two days, but I can always get it done again tomorrow. Let's continue and head to the markets. Shout out to my mate uh, Jay for actually uh, recommending this place because I didn't had no idea where to go in Bali and 
everyone recommended this place right here so shout out to guys there it's actually they close at six and it's like six something already so they're staying back just to do a tattoo for me i was hoping to finish off my back you guys can't see but my my back is not done as of yet but it was gonna take five to seven hours and we don't have that much of time because tomorrow we actually fly back. So I've always wanted to finish off my fingers, right? So I'm a big fan of my finger tattoos, right? But I only like patterns and like just like little things on my finger. So I'll show you guys, everything literally does have a meaning. So I'm doing the semicolon uh, for personal reasons, personal reason meanings. And if you guys don't know what the semicolon tattoo is, maybe Philly can tell you. I'm dealing with customs at the moment because my stuff is stuck in customs. But the semi tattoo is for depression, uh, anxiety, and uh, just awareness of that. And then I'm going to do a Pisces symbol because obviously I'm a Pisces. And then I'm going to do two triangles um, on my thumb as well. And then I'm going to do the diamond, a diamond, and uh, it's going to—it's actually a mixture of a diamond and a love heart because obviously. Uh, it's my ongoing battle between money and actually what I do for a living, like what I love doing for a living. Yeah, because uh, someone actually asked me on the vlogs, uh, actually, let me get my phone, give me one second, oh, it's in my pocket. You guys actually requested me to bring this back into the vlogs, and this is why. Okay, so Yash, Yash asked me, what do you value most in my life? The most valuable thing in my life is actually being able to do what I love and getting paid for it and just being content. Like I really don't, I don't need to make a million dollars, I don't make, need to make two million dollars. I just need to be content and do what I love and be able to do it every single day. And this is one of it right now. So um, yeah, let's get this tattoo done. straight but like it is straight but if I go like this it looks yeah it looks all weird but I'm gonna do two more I'm gonna do one here and one on the other finger so what I've decided to do I'll show you on this computer I'm gonna do this because you guys know I love my puppies and this dog is gonna be sick and conveniently I'm playing with dreams on the TV and the dogs are so cute done with his tattoos and now it's time to go eat some dinner and we're going back to the place that we had dinner at last night. I feel like whenever we find a place that we like to eat at, we always just go back again just because we love it. So it's just like our Hong Kong place that we ate for like five days non-stop. Yeah, I know, right? This is the place here. Oh my god, do you have corn flip? Yes, they do have corn flip. Look at this. Follow my friends. How are you? How are you today? Good. Yeah. Uh, great thing about this place, you can order what you want. Uh, can I get a kilo of corn? Yes. And also, can I get one lobster as well? Yes. Yeah. I will take the best one for you. Big 
excited for the lobster leg. I know, we haven't had lobster this whole time and now like it's so big and it looks juicy and meaty. Thanks so for And morning glory for the Oh, what is that? Dinner is 110 percent served now. Morning glory, love this. This beautiful lobster. Whole bunch of points. Are you so excited? Like just look at this, just watch this food porn right here. Oh my god. Look at that meat, and then you just dip it in. Mm. It's actually so good. So good. good. It's not even pretending. It's so fun. No, I'm like legit serious. Yeah. <laughs> As you guys can see in between here, we have some prawn left, right? And Tilly peeled it. She's gonna feed some stray cats. But now she wants to feed the stray dogs. I'm too scared to feed the cats. <laughs> And she's trying to like low key look a little bit. We're gonna go. Ahead. We're gonna go. She really wants to feed the dogs at the villa. There's some stray dogs at the villa. Look, <laughs> look how meaty that is. No, get one more. You get four, babe. You can't just have two. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm gonna get another tissue. You're burritoing it. You can't, you can't make a tissue burritos. The girl watching you, babe. 